So the first thing I want to do is uh, take off this hood because uh, the engine is going to come out a lot easier with the hood off, I think. So uh, it looks like there's a couple of bolts on the other side of these two plastic things which I can take off. Um, but as you can see from the inside here, they're a little adjustable, so I'd rather leave those intact. Instead, there's another bolt uh, right down in here uh, that I want to take off. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but I gotta take off this whole guard in order to get that bolt out. So the hood's a little heavy, so I've enlisted the help of my brother, Glenn, to help me uh, pop it off. So now we got the hood off, the next thing to do is take the bed off. So now I'm just going to be under here, unplugging all the electrical connections for things like the tail lights and reversing lights and things of that nature. And then I'll be unbolting all the bolts that hold this bed in and we'll pop it off. I've also got to undo all these bolts. Now I'm just going to take off all these bolts that hold the bed to the frame and I'll use my impact wrench for that. Nice and easy. What is it off now? Off? Everything's, yeah, off? everything's off. Where are we going? It's in, in the other bag. It's not going to fit that way. Look at Glenn, just hold it up, man! Look at this one on that other corner. So, we finally completed what I would consider to be one major piece of deconstruction. Because as you can see, the bed is no longer on the truck. So what this means is I can begin doing things like uh, taking out the engine after I back the truck into the garage. I can take out the exhaust, I can take out the gas tank, we can take out all the old gasser bits. And then we can begin putting in all the brand new shiny EV bits. And all that will be coming tomorrow and in future videos. So stay tuned and thanks for watching. Coming up on Electro TV. Okay, I have officially decided that whoever designed this truck was a moron. More fluids are dream. We checked the time. And Scott cleans up after a Freon disaster. So stay tuned to Electruck TV.